In this Android Basics video, we're going to show you how to transfer your data from an iPhone to an Android phone, all without a cable. Thanks for watching 95 Google on YouTube. Be sure to thumbs up, hit subscribe, and then enable notifications with the bell icon so that you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Before switching to your new Android phone, we want to do a couple of things first to ensure we transfer all of your important information and documents. It is worth noting though that using this method, you won't be able to transfer your SMS messages. Unfortunately, these will be left on your iPhone. Firstly, it's important that you disable iMessage to ensure a smooth transition and that you don't miss out on further SMS messages on your new Android phone. To do so on your iPhone, head to Settings, Messages, now toggle iMessage off, and now we're ready to go. This easy method relies on Google Drive, so head to the App Store to download it, and once it's ready, sign into the account you want to use with your Android phone. To backup, head to Menu, Settings, and now Backup. Now you can choose just what files you want to backup, including calendars, contacts, photos, and videos. To start your backup, just scroll down and select Start Backup. It's worth noting that this process can take several hours depending on just how much data you are backing up and the speed of your Wi-Fi data connection. We advise plugging your iPhone into a charger during this process to ensure that the battery doesn't die and therefore your backup isn't lost. When this process is complete, on your new Android phone, sign into your Google account and during the setup process you will be prompted to restore from a backup if you do have any. You'll notice that your iPhone will not be listed as all of your data will actually be found within the photos, contacts and calendar apps without you needing to restore your entire device. So that's all there is to it, a painless process that doesn't need a cable. If you do have any questions, pop them down below. Thanks for watching our Android Basics series, here to help you get the most from your Android devices.